Trying to be an athlete, he finds Drake London on the move. Out past the 35-yard line, they convert on third down. Rook 30 pounds. Here is Algier, he's got a lot of running room. And he gets inside the 25-yard line. The 23, it's Algier again. And Tyler Algier with purpose inside the 10-yard line. Fake it to Algier. Ritter rolling. Ritter floats it. It is caught for his first NFL touchdown. Michael Pruitt snares it, and Ritter's got his score. You want to talk about keeping the play alive? You're running through traffic. You're getting bumped. You're getting hit. You're getting held. <laughs> Just keep going, man. Find your, get off me. Just find a way to get yourself open. I tell you what, that is great. Put an offensive line together that's been able to compete. Third grab for Chris Godwin, and that ball may have come out loose near the 35-yard line. Atlanta's already claiming that it has it. Hawkins is very fired up for it. See Troy Anderson claiming that it should be Atlanta ball. And these are the things that have just derailed this offense. I mean, last week, Godwin puts it on the ground in yep. that first D simply because offensively, they've had so many struggles. Yep. Young Wei Koo from 49 hit the game winner at the horn against Arizona last week and continues to be rock solid. Bucks are averaging five per carry. That play got absolutely destroyed by Grady Jarrett. Blitz off the edge, picked up by Algier. He still got hit, did Ritter, and he threw it on target to Pruitt. It's the longest catch of Pruitt's season. Here comes Algier, and another first down. It's first and goal. And how much tighter you got to be with all that speed out there on both ends of the field. 24-yarder for Young Wake. Been to make another impact in his sophomore campaign next year. Here's Algier. And Algier slips ahead. Ritter. Now buying time. Reclimbing the pocket. Throws on the move, and he's got his man for a first down. Ritter. Looking for another one. It's a wide open Olamide Zacchaeus for the touchdown. And the Falcons jump out in front late in the third. FaceTimed into the team and got to communicate with him. Just, just good updates all throughout this week and just good news to hear. Bernard gets hit hard. Good play by Lorenzo Carter for a loss. What a star at left tackle. So consistent. Ritter launches. Got a man. It's London. It's a big gainer inside the 40 at Tampa Bay. Confidence to know. Yeah. That's where I want to go with it. Go ahead. Let it eat. Hand to Patterson. He walks in. It's a touchdown for Atlanta. You get to a hot streak at just the right sure. time. Timing. A little fortuitous nature of this game. Big run. Tyler Algier. He's not done yet. Blitz coming. Ritter stands in, throws on target, first down to Zacchaeus. It's, it's nice to see those type of guys get rewarded and get the opportunities. Nice job by Koo. He kept that straight. So this year, but remember, they beat Philadelphia in the playoff game, the wild card game last year, where they shut down that impressive Philadelphia rushing attack. Trask on fourth down, looking, and it's incomplete. You run for Williams. Trying to pick it up. Oh, he picked it up. He got the first down. That should do it. He's disappointed. Kyle Trask, because he wanted to go deep <laughs> he again. Wanted, he wanted to take one more deep shot. One more deep shot. Well, a nice finish for Atlanta to the season. Todd Bowles.